white, the German colors, the Nazi swastika, the Iron Cross for tradition and valor. The new Governor General and Lady Tweedsmuir arrive at Quebec, and Lord Tweedsmuir expresses their pleasure. My wife and I are looking forward to five years of duty, but we are also looking forward to five years of happiness in a land which we love and a land where we already have so many friends. Then, still in Quebec, Lord Tweedsmuir is installed in office with stately formality. He was Colonel John Buchan, renowned as historian of the World War, a distinguished journalist and a famous novelist too. He is a Scot and has been a member of parliament for the Scottish universities and head of the Church of Scotland. A unique film record is made as the oath is administered and then Lord Tweedsmuir signs the oath book taking office at a time of political change in Canada, for the Liberal Party has just come into power. So his chief collaborator is Mr. Mackenzie King, the Prime Minister, who also signs the book. Canada faces her problems under a new government, a new Premier and a new Governor-General. <laughs>